All right, well, here's the top portion of the beginnings of the aquaponics thing. I've got, uh, put some minnows in there. Where's my zoom? I put two dozen minnows in there and I've lost like a total of six or seven so far. And I ain't even put no food in there. They're all just eating the junk that's accumulated on the bottom. Just minnows from a bait shop. Just to see how long they would live in there. Well, I got a thing flowing. In fact, I got it overflowing. I accidentally unplugged the pump as I was adding water to it and uh, started overflowing down here at the end. By the way, I'm on my new scooter. So it's going to be a little shaky here, but yeah, she got a little full. But that's all right. It'll just uh, add some water down here and some spots. But here's the my Hugo culture pile set up, and I uh, got my stuff together in the wheelbarrow to start putting some plants in. I got some hay, got some a little bit of topsoil to add around the plants, and. Uh, Behind it there, you could we'll take a little ride around. Here's my uh, cabbage plants and stuff that uh, overwintered and they're already into flowering. They're growing right up and flowering. Uh, some onions are popping up too. And uh, right now we just put down some wet soaking wet layers of cardboard and I got Tony my helper here laying down uh, the compost that we made ourselves we've already finished that part of it up to the corner and here's my plants got some nice tomatoes uh, got some lemon slicing cucumbers and I think that's all I got out here right now but uh, in the greenhouse I started all these from seed in the greenhouse I got some eggplant and some cucumbers some regular cucumbers but uh I, yeah this is the the cart my, my gurney that I made from an old uh, chaise lounge and some wheelchair wheels. Yeah, it, it's nice for moving glass of plants around or the wet cardboard. In fact, they uh, soak the cardboard in the, in the creek, in the pond up there. But uh, yeah, this one's all ready to plant over here. So we'll get some stuff going there. See this stuff is nice, nice and dark, almost like muck. That turned out really nice. I like that a lot. I have made a nice layer of compost underneath, and then I got some soil over here that we, uh, we emptied out the potato tires. Here's all the uh, leftover tires. I got them covered up so they don't gather up water and make little mosquito nests and stuff. But those will be going back into the ground soon because I got uh, some Yukon, some Yukon Gold and uh, some uh, Purple Majesties. Oh man, my battery is dying again already. All right, looks like I'm gonna have to make a second film. But there's the soil we'll be putting on top of the compost. See if I got enough time here. This is the uh, the gizmo that I made for rolling the compost around. This is going to be a new set, fresh set. Made up with a, a gamble, a gamble system. 
the pulley system that enables me to pull it up and contain the water in it a little bit. And uh, I actually got some raw glycerin I just learned about that you can mix with water and it helps speed up the composting process and adds some nutrients and stuff to it. My battery isn't dead yet. Well, it's getting there. Uh, hopefully I can zip over here and show you the compost. Yeah, I put all new fencing around it, around the compost bin, but that's the that's the spot where we uh, got the good uh, the old stuff. Stuff that's been around for a while and the worms have had a chance to get to it and break it down. Like I said, it looks like looks like a swamp that somebody burnt down. <laughs> that's nice rich soil or compost. Oh, there's my uh, garlic patch. I started that last fall. And speaking of gambling, we'll see if we got just enough time here to show you. I tore up the tore up the pond, the big pond. Uh, I'm gonna put a big uh, pole in the center of it, nice and uh, sturdy, and I'm going to build a Savonius wind turbine right in the middle of this that uh, drives a, an old transaxle that I've got that will uh, eventually drive a uh, an air compressor or a water pump or just about anything I want. And that's it. Before this, uh, before I lose the whole video, I'm gonna stop for now. See ya.